I was anxious, but I needed help. And when I came in the door, that's what I, I was looking for. And the girl I met was Melanie, and she said, would you like a cup of tea? And I went, oh, I'd just love a wee cup of tea. We say hello, nice to see you, or whatever, you know, when they come in. Again, we get tea and biscuits or cakes, whatever, somebody might bring something in. Do you know what I mean? It's, mm -hmm. it's just a nice group. Mm -hmm. All the groups are nice that we've went to anyway, nice people in them. Oh, it changed a lot. It got me out of the house. Um, I had reason to get up and put my makeup on, do my hair and dress a wee bit better. Um, and then I knew I was going to see my friends. I've had this illness 25 years, and it's an illness that consumes you, uh, being mentally ill, and you've, you've got to try and not let it consume you, which is very difficult. Yes, I met, I met Frances. Frances stays around the corner from me. She stayed in her house 32 years, and I was 33 years in my old house. And we never, our past never crossed. Francis comes to the flat twice a week just now because the Friday group's off. And we, we always have our dinner. And then once we tidy up, if we want to bake, we bake. If not, we just sit and have a chat. It's a very good place to be. It's nice to be part of it. Um, it certainly helped me in my life. I would say I'm they're friends with me now. That's the way I would like to look at it. I'm friends with healthy and happy.